Hi everybody, this is David again, and uh, for the next two weeks we're going to be studying Amos. So I am at the base of Herodian. I'll have to show you a picture of what that looks like. But I'm looking southwest because I want to show you uh, Amos' hometown. I think you can see in the video you've got this little valley over here. That's, called, that's the Wadi of Tekoa. And just above that, in uh, that hill, you've got the village of Tekoa. That's where Amos would have been from. Uh, in Amos 1.1 it says that he was a, sh a sheep herder. And so you, uh, you can see there's not a ton of greenery. Um, from where I'm standing I can see that there, there are some orchards here. But for the most part it's a little too dry for a good agricultural community. Instead it would be probably better suited for a, sh a shepherd like, uh, like Amos. And so I wanted to show you what this looks like. We're, we're south of, of, of uh, Jerusalem, south of Bethlehem, about half hour drive in the southern Judean hills, uh, pretty dry. And you can kind of just imagine the shepherd out here pronouncing judgment on almost every single nation that surrounds his tiny town, including Judah itself. So uh, he's pronouncing judgment on Judah, on Israel to the north, on Damascus, on, the, on Philistia, on the Phoenician coast, on the Arameans, on more basically anybody uh, that's, uh, that's surrounding his country is getting a little piece of of, of his of his mind and uh, I just wanted to show you this visual of this relatively lonely peaceful hill and uh, where, where Amos would have had his own profession he wasn't a professional prophet and uh, he, you can see this the shepherd out here uh, getting this word and pronouncing judgment on every single nation that, that he's border, that's bordering him so anyway just want to give you that visual hope you enjoyed it